Today I share with you the Throne Dragonfly. What's going on Throne Army? Here is the Throne Epic Dragonfly Gen 4 C30. Uh, this was an amazing experience and it came out unbelievable. First I want to thank Epic for uh, giving me the opportunity to design my own Dragonfly. Uh, it has been a lifelong passion of mine to design things and doing the kind of the next level stuff with um, a shaft was definitely amazing. So thank you to you guys. Uh, I want to give you the backstory before I actually tell you about this thing. This started at LaxCon, the last list past LaxCon. I got to meet with James and Ryan who run Epic and they are awesome people. We shared a lot of mutual um, interest being a fellow hockey and lacrosse players and just uh, kind of on a design level, on an inspiration level, on an innovation level. Uh, we shared a lot in common. It was really amazing meeting with them and they approached me about designing my own Dragonfly and uh, try to play it cool. Try to play it cool. I don't think I did. I think I replied to him with like, oh my god, I'm so excited. But uh, it was definitely amazing and they pretty much gave me free reign. James really respected my uh, design background and kind of let me do whatever I wanted. So it was really cool. So did a bunch of mock-ups, asked all the throne boys and friends. So I'll thank you all guys for helping me out. And this is what we decided on. I sent it over to, I sent a few over to James and he picked this one out and he's like, let's do it. And it came out unbelievable. So first off, we went with the Gen 4. It is a great um, introduction to the Epic line. It's got an amazing balance between flex, stiffness, uh, balance. It's just an amazing shaft. Um, I have a Gen 5 right now that I've been testing out, and I still prefer the Gen 4. I think once I get used to the Gen 5, it's much uh, higher flex profile. But the Gen 4 is a great balance, and uh, this stick just literally just sits in your hands. I find myself really not gripping it very hard, and uh, it just feels unbelievable. We wanted to base the... Uh, well, first off, I didn't want to just wrap a dragonfly and throne stuff and call it a throne shaft. I really wanted to work with them and their technology to make a shaft that I would really, really want to play with. Um, and uh, I think um, you guys would want to play with. That's just some, what I would want. Um, that's kind of what I do here. I just kind of create what I want and I'm lucky enough that you guys really, really love it and enjoy it. So first thing I want to do is go with just kind of a standard shape. I really like their C30 shape and that's what we went with. But um, I like grip to my shaft. I usually tape most of my shaft. But for this, um, they have an amazing sandpaper grip to them that doesn't really wear off like it does on some other shafts. So I wanted to go with that because I wanted the graphics to really stand out and I didn't want to tape the whole shaft. So we want the traditional shape with the grip and it has an unbelievable feel to it. Um, everyone that has seen it so far kind of just picks up and goes, wow, wow. And I'm like, yeah, I know, it's, it's dope. And so this one was really cool. And then when we get down to the graphics, um, I really wanted to do something where anytime you're holding it, you get a hint of Epic or a hint of Throne and uh, a little kind of like secret design to it. Um, I always love stuff like that. And um, Epic does that. They have very subtle designs. So I wanted to take their aesthetic and I wanted to take kind of the Throne Army aesthetic and throw it together. So up top we have Live, Play, Be, which is their motto. And then we have Epic. Then we have the big Throne Crest up here, which I love while you're holding the stick. It's just your eye gets drawn right to it. Then we got yellow bars coming down. They do the neon green in most of their shafts. I thought it'd be cool to do Throne. And then we have Dragonfly with Special Edition, which I think is so cool that it says Special Edition on it. Got more bars. And then down here is the little secret. It says throwing a string at the bottom. Now, my buddy Pipe Crusher uh, literally just sent back like emoticons of heart smiley faces when I sent him that photo. Um, so I knew I had a winner because uh, he has unbelievable taste in gear. And then we have the reverse from the up top down here. And then we have, oops, lamp, have a white uh, epic throne cap on it or white epic end cap on it. Um, it just looks clean, especially with the white head. I can't wait to check it out. So that's pretty much everything, guys. They're going to be $149 and only going to be available on throwinastring.com. And they are in super, super limited quantity. We're going to release them tomorrow at noon, Saturday at noon. So if you guys want one, you're definitely going to uh, have to run over there pretty quickly. Uh, I think noon's a good time. It's when the first um, NCAA games kick off. So um, it'll be a good time. Everyone's going to be up and amped for those. So we're going to kick them off at noon. Um, of course, let me know what you guys think of the Throne Dragonfly in the comments below. And I just want to thank uh, James and Ryan again at Epic for giving me the opportunity to create something so, so awesome with them. So that's everything, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. And I'm uh, looking forward to see who picks these up. Um, if any of you guys are getting them, I'd love to see uh, what heads and what setups you do. Uh, be sure to th uh, tag me on Instagram at Throne String. I'd uh, love to check it out. That's everything, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. And I'll talk to you guys soon.